Gilman reporting for KD Chats at the Grand River Film Festival in Kitchener, Ontario with Craig Norris, the host of CBC's morning show on CBC KW. How does it feel to be here as the host for the festival tonight? Uh, it's great. I, I love doing stuff like this. It's an honor to, to be asked to do stuff like this. Plus, I get to see a movie for free, so that's a pretty good deal. Awesome. <laughs> what is the importance of grassroots film festivals and showing Canadian film to you? Well, I think that, uh, you know, first of all, I think we've sort of removed that whole stigma of Canadian film. You know what I mean? Like, I don't think, I don't think that really exists anymore. I remember when I was a kid a long time ago, there was always that vibe to Canadian movies. You're kind of like, oh, this is a Canadian movie. It's so bleak, you know. Uh, but now I think Canadian film has just become world class. And I mean, t when it comes to fostering it um, locally, I mean, if you really want to just talk about the brass tacks of the economy, the things that, 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 that film does for an economy, a local economy, in a whole bunch of different spheres is amazing. But what it does culturally is harder to measure, but it's probably even more important, you know? Yeah. And what has it been like for you working at CBC KW, and what's been the best part of that experience so far? Uh, the best part of it, I used to work for a bunch of national shows, and the best part of it is it's, it's a lot more immediate. Mm. You know, I mean, I, when I leave the building, People are always telling me what story we should be doing. Uh, people are immediate, like they'll come right up to you. There's immediate feedback. If I'm in a Zares or something like that, people <laughs> will stop me and say, I didn't like the way you treated so-and-so or why were you so easy on this person or why were you so hard on this person? Um, so, I mean, that, that's been the best part. And I'm from here. I'm from like southwestern Ontario. Boring, I know, but I've never lived outside of the listening area of our station ever in my life. So. For me to basically come home and do this kind of show and talk about local politics and talk about local culture and I get to program all the music on the show so I play like 95% local musicians too so I mean that's it's it's just great everything about this is great yeah and you're also a local musician what what types of shows do you have coming up uh, we're actually recording a brand new record right now so we don't yeah we don't have any shows coming up hopefully uh, the record will be out I'm gonna say like late January, early February, so there'll be a new record. So we spend like all of our time recording right now. So um, that's basically all we're doing until CD release parties, yeah. And people still even make CDs, I don't even know. but I... <laughs> They can. <laughs> and what advice would you give to an interviewer like myself? Um, you know the best advice I ever got was, uh, listen. And you have been, you've been great. Yeah. Why, are you worried that well, you're- I'm in and out, you know. No, no, no. <laughs> You haven't, you're not that engaging, Craig, I'm sorry. Um, no, but, but really listen. I mean, like that's the, the main thing is, and, and don't worry about um, going off whatever sort of mental script you have ever. Just, just whatever you feel like asking, ask, you know? And, and if, if it's making you think you need to ask it, then you should ask it. You did a great job though. Thank you, thank you so much. Congratulations and have a great time tonight. Thank you, thanks Katie. Thank you. I'm Katie Allman reporting for Katie Chats at the Grand River Film Festival in Kitchener, Ontario. Thank you.